All right, so welcome back to uh, how to play uh, the hare and the tortoise. So we're just about to get started to play the game. I explained how to play the game in the last uh, video. So if you haven't watched that video, and this is the first video you're watching for this particular game, I encourage you to watch that first before watching gameplay. Now let's get started. So I have the uh, first player token first. So I'm going first. So, let's see here. What cards should I play? Or should I say, which animal should I play first? Hmm, let's see here. I think I'll hold on to my that one there for a while. Um, and these, oh, yeah, okay, let's try not to play those. I want to try to save those four cards for later. And we'll play these two and see what happens. Or should I say we'll play one of these two first? Hmm... Okay, maybe uh, we'll play this one first. We'll play the lamb first. That's the only animal I'm playing right now. Now, you can play more than one of the same animal card, but you can only place a maximum of four of that same one. But I'm only going to obviously I only have one of those, so that's all I'm going to play anyway. So now it's Manta's turn. So Manta, what does Manta have? What is Manta going to play? Hmm, still don't know exactly know who he's rooting for either. But, um, well, hmm, he's got some good cards here. Um, I think he's going to play the two foxes for his turn. So Manta is going to decide on the two foxes for his turn. Okay, and we'll have to make sure to remember that at the end of this round, he's going to draw until he has six cards. So he's going to need two more at least, and I'm going to need one more at least. Okay, now, what is Ridley going to play for his turn? <gasps> He's got a tortoise. He's got another tortoise. Does he have more? He does not. I think he's going to hold on to him for now so he can try to get that tortoise to move as much as possible. That's what I would do. Hmm. Looks like he's going to play the two sheep for his turn. So now the sheep is going to move... Three spaces, it looks like, so far. And the fox is going to move two spaces, it looks like, so far. All right, so that's his turn. Now it would be my turn because we only have five cards out thus far. So, so now it's my turn, six, seven, eight. Well, let's see here. I guess we'll go with the hare as my next choice. So now we've got six cards out. So now it's Manta's turn. Hmm. Well, it looks like he's going to go for the hare as well this time around. Okay. And then Ridley goes. And it looks like he is going to be also going with the hair as well okay and so now we have a total of eight cards out so now the race begins and we'll see how far they get so obviously the hair goes first so the hair he is just going to move two spaces because it doesn't really matter how many cards are out as long as there's at least one he gets to move two spaces so he's going to go one and two we technically actually put them on this thing but you guys can't really see them then if I do it that way. So we'll do it this way so you can see them a little bit better. Well, oh, a little bit anyway. All right. So now these get discarded. Okay. The tortoise would be next. There are no tortoise cards out. However, he still moves one space anyways because of that, because of his ability. Slow and steady will win the race. Maybe. Then the wolf would go next, but he has no cards out at all, so he isn't going anywhere. Looks like he had a late start. Must not be uh, dark enough for him to play yet, to race yet. All right, then it's the fox's turn, and he's pretty crafty. He gets to move two spaces as well. All right, so now the fox is tied in first place so far, and the fox will then, those cards will get discarded. Now the sheep, the sheep, gets to move three spaces. 
because there's three of his cards out. And so the lamb goes here. So now the lamb is in first place, and the wolf is in last place. And that's the end of the first round. So then these will get discarded. We will all draw until we have six cards. I need two, two more cards. So we'll just go ahead and draw them right off the bat. Um, Manta needs... Oops, he needs three cards, because he's only got three. And Ridley also needs three cards. So here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. And here you go. And here you go, Manta. All right. So now... Manta will be going first in this round. All right. So, let's see what he's got here. Well, he's got one tortoise. He's got two foxes now. Hmm. Looks like he's going to go with the fox. He really, maybe, he was, maybe he's uh, betting on the fox to win. Who knows? But he's going to go ahead and play two foxes for his turn. All right, now it's Ridley's turn. So let's see what Ridley has here. Well, he's got two tortoises now, two hares. Hmm, he's also got a wolf with the howl ability. But he has nothing else for the wolf except for that. Hmm, well, looks like he is going to go for two hares. Yep, looks like that's what he's going to do. So he's going to play the two hares. Okay, now it's my turn. What am I going to play? Please tell me I got some more of that particular card. Oh, I certainly did. Okay. Well, this will end it this round. I am going to play one, two, three. And I'm also going to play a fourth tortoise. So that ends it, regardless, because there's a maximum of eight anyway. So, now the race will continue. And the hare obviously always goes first. And so the hare is going to move two spaces. So now the hare is in the lead. Now the tortoise is going to go. There are four tortoise cards out. So the tortoise is actually going to get to move two spaces. So now the tortoise is right behind that pesky hare. All right, then it's the wolf's turn. But once again, the wolf isn't going anywhere anytime soon. Then we've got the fox. The fox gets to move two spaces. So now they're all like neck and neck. And then the lamb would go next, but there are no lamb cards out. So the lamb is staying put for this round. All right, so do you think who's going to win now? Can you uh, guys... Picture who's going to win. Is it going to be the hare? Is it going to be the tortoise? Is it going to be the fox? Who knows? Could be any one of them. All right. So now, that's the end of the second round of the phase. I need four more cards. And they need, looks like, two each. Yes, they need two each. So let's do them first. So I don't get mixed up here. Okay. And then I need four. Okay. So now for this round, Ridley gets to go first. All right. So Ridley. What's Ridley going to play for his turn? <gasps> He's got some wolves. Oh, he could do it. He could do it. Is he going to? Yeah, he is. Look at that. He is going to play all three of his wolves. All right. Well, we uh, that's not four, so obviously it would be my turn next. So, did I get any more wolves? I did not. Well, hmm. I guess I'll play my... I guess I'll play three sheeps. Yeah, yeah, I'll play three sheeps. I don't need them anyways. I'm not rooting for the sheep. Don't tell them that though. They didn't. Their ears. Their hearing isn't that good. All right. 
so, I'm not rooting for the sheep. So, um, we'll play them. And then that's, now it's Manta's turn. So now he gets to put something down. Ooh, he could get some wolves out, for sure. Hmm. Let's see here. Well, looks like he's going to play a wolf as well. Hold on to his other wolf. And uh, so that's it, folks, for this round. So now the racing begins again. Now, there is a wolf howl in play. When that happens, none of the other animals can move because they're too afraid of the howl. So now the wolf is finally going to get to move. So these get discarded because, once again, none of the other animals get to move anyways. So since there are four cards out, he would move four spaces minus one. So he's going to get to move a maximum of three spaces. One, two, and three. So now he's caught up to everybody else. And nobody else got to move that round. So, it could be anybody's game now. <laughs> All right. All right, so that's the end of this video. We'll, we'll see you guys in the next part.